Hello, my name is Metin Aradashir. This is 271st part of explanation of my theory. According to my theory and my formulas, anti-lecture, wrong effective nuclear charge formula, Z effective of accepted physics. This is wrong. Z effective blurry concept totally fake made up blurred fuzzy concept here Rydberg constant Rydberg constant for hydrogen here is equals to 28.10 to the minus 19 joules. It has no, it has no place here. It has no place here. This formula is the formula for multi-electron atoms ionization energies. And this formula is wrong formula. In accepted physics theories. How? Yes. This page is quote from MIT Open Courseware, sound subject, neutral electron atoms, instructor Catherine Drena. Quote here. According to this quote, Left side for one electron atoms. Okay, here proton number originally, but right side for multi electron atoms where effective nuclear charges is not the same as Z. Here, in this quote, they made sample for helium, multi electron atoms. Helium have two electrons, and for two possibilities, They imagine two extreme cases. First extreme case for them, Z effective, total shin shielding case, 2.18 10 to the minus 19 joules or 21.8 10 to the minus 19 joules, same thing. Okay, extreme case for A, for an electron, and extreme case B, Z effective 2, 8.72 times to the minus 18 joules, no shielding. Then, experimentally determined ionization energy, they say, 3.94 10 to the minus 18 joules. Okay. 
four and IE three point ten ninety four ten to minus eighteen joule. They find from experimentally measured ionization energy a near effective Z or effective nuclear charge. This is fake. Why? Yes. Why? According to me, this is hydrogen atom. 21.8 10 to the minus joules belongs to only hydrogen atom. Okay. Here, helium atom, according to me, there are two wavelength size, two different wavelength size electron motion form. Here, for hydrogen, 91.155 nanometer, single electron motion form, joint motion with proton. There are two protons, and for each proton, a different size electron motion form. Smallest one is 22. This is the code for spectral lines that I predicted certainly. 22.8 nanometer, small, smallest electron motion form, and corresponding ionization energy is 87.2, 10 to the minus 19 joules, or the same. For with what? 8.72 times minus 18 joules. Same. 87 point 10 to the minus 19 joules, the same here. And greater electron, pay attention, greater electron wavelength is 50.44. Corresponding ionization energy is 39.4, 10 to the minus 19 joules. Here, experimentally same, 30.94, 10 to the minus 18 joules. The same, 30 to the, here, this is minus 18, this is 19, minus 19, the same, 9, 39.4. 39, 10 to the minus 18, 10 to the minus 19, here, 3.94, 10 to the minus 18, the same. This is greater electron motion forms ionization energy, corresponding 50.44 nanometer. Here, snapshot. Okay, these are two codes, these are two codes that I put forth and I determined electron, determined helium spectral lines completely. Here are my formulas. Like what? Like this. This is helium atom. Right side, my prediction according to my theory and my formulas. Left side, National Institute of Standards and Technology Observational Exper Experimental Data Measurement. Okay, line by line, approximately the same. They are the same. But there are two different, there are two different codes uh, corresponding spe spectral lines. Okay, smallest, 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 smallest electron motion form. 22.80, 22.8 nanometer wavelength size. Okay. Yes. Here. Greater electron motion forms. 50.44.
four nanometer wavelength size greater electrons determined wavelength size. Okay. And here. Yes. This formula with these with these formulas you cannot find these spectral lines. Okay. You can never find spectral lines that I determined according to my theory and my formulas. Yes. Now, they unknowingly measure the ionization energy of the first electron. What first electron? This is first electron. Return. They, unknown, they unknowingly measure the ionization energy of the first electron. Here, greater electron motion forms ionization energy 39.39 10 to the minus 19 joules. This is first ionization energy. Okay. Corresponding 50.44 nanometer wavelength size. They, here, mine, they unknowingly measure the ionization energy of the first electron, but attribute that ionization energy to something else called Z effective. Effective nuclear charge. They attribute unknowingly this an ionization energy to this. Okay, Exper they say experimentally. And here again, this is experimentally also. They didn't discern what was what is going on here. Yes. They unknowingly measure the ionization energy of the first electron, but attribute that ionization energy to something else called ZF. What ZF? Effective nuclear charge. ZF. What was Z? Z was the number of protons. Okay? Then, the Z was converted into a fuzzy effective nuclear charge, ZF. What is this proton number covered in? This number of protons is involved in electrical attraction and repulsion subject. Okay, again, again, what is the proton number covered in? This number of protons is involved in electric attraction repulsion subject, but according to me, there were no such an electric medium in the context of action at a distance in an atom. If there were, if there were such a medium, I wouldn't manage. I wouldn't manage to determine to determine the multi electron atom spectral lines values at certain levels. Yes. Don't forget. This is wrong. Here, in short explanation according to my theory and my formulas. Have a good evening. I will go on to tell you my theory and formulas step by step. Have a good evening. See you later.